Good morning, everybody. It is bright and early here in the Bright family household. But welcome to the Bright Family Vlogs, where every day there is a bright side. And if you would like to be a part of our family, click that red subscribe button and don't forget to click that icon bell so you can get notifications every time we post videos. Today is the first day of school. Getting up early, getting going. It's crazy, you don't realize how early you're getting up or how fast the time flies when you're getting up that early. It's like, oh my gosh, I feel like I just woke up. I haven't got my hair done yet, but my makeup's done. Brady goes a little bit later than the other kids. Gracie's already up and ready. Ethan is getting ready, right? I guess like Ethan's getting ready. They have to leave here. It is 6.23 a.m. right now, and they have to leave here to get to the bus stop about 6.45 at the latest, I would say. Um, it is the first day of school, so a lot of times the buses run a little bit on the later side, and we have construction on our road, so it's hard saying what time the bus will come. Hopefully they don't miss it because I can't leave to take them this year because I have to be here getting Brady ready because he leaves an hour later. Brady doesn't have a bus for his school. I will actually be driving him. He goes to a charter school. And we're gonna be taking some pictures here in a few minutes. It's still dark outside, which is kind of a bum deal because I like to get pictures outside. Um, we had a big rainstorm last night, so I don't know why, if that's why it's still dark. Right now, Gracie is eating her breakfast. She's all ready. This one is exciting. Couldn't sleep, could ya? No, I don't know why the moon's still there. You don't know why the moon's still out? It's early, isn't it? We have to leave here about 7.40 for you. And who are we gonna meet who's gonna come to school with us today? Granny. Granny. Mm -hmm. Granny's gonna come with you to see you go to school. And we've got your sign here. We're gonna take pictures with. This is Brady's first day of kindergarten, August 27th, 2018. I want to be a policeman when I grow up. My teacher is Mrs. Hotelling. I am five years old, 48 inches, 51 pounds, in class of 2031. That is a long time. It'll go by really fast though. Gracie is 2024, and then Ethan is 2020. <gasps> So yeah, you're 11 years after Ethan graduates is when you graduate. Yeah. That's crazy. You know how old Ethan will be? He'll be almost 30 when you graduate. <laughs> you have your lunch all put in the sacks, on your lunch mm -hmm. sacks. I'm ready. It went by super fast. Yeah. I actually woke up an hour earlier than I was supposed to. I woke up at like 3.45. Because you were excited. Because <laughs> you were excited. At least you're eating. A little healthy bowl of Cheerios. Mm -hmm. Look at that bed head. <laughs> you ready for kindergarten? I don't know if Mama's ready for you to go to kindergarten, but I don't have any choice. Gracie's going to seventh. It's not so hard with you going to seventh. Next year you'll be going to the eight nine building, so that's going to be a little different. But. And then Ethan will be a senior. Gosh, I have like milestones like every year. Ethan will be a senior next year. You'll be going into the 8-9 building. That's not a milestone. Kind of. I mean, ninth grade's a milestone. And then, that's it. Brady will be going to first grade. It's Rachel's first day of senior year. It's her first day of senior year, yep. We're gonna wait for Ethan to come down. I'm gonna start getting some pictures here so they can get to the bus stop. Here's Gracie's first day of school outfit. I'm afraid that the cuffs look bad. No. Everybody wears them up. Especially as hot as it is. Is it humid out? Yeah. You look cute. You ready? Mm -hmm. You nervous? No. But my first class is PLCW, and like I've seen other people go to PLCW, I've been to PLCW. You know what bus to get on when you get to high school? Mom always makes them hold a sign. Here he is, the junior. All ready? Yeah. All right, get your shoes on. I'm gonna take a picture. Are you nervous, Ethan? No. You tired? Yeah. What time did you go to bed? About, is that when you fell asleep? 
Only time I let the kids wear their shoes in the house is when they're brand new and haven't been outside yet. <laughs> Off they go. Bye. 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 <laughs> Can you see them through the pine trees, Brady? Yeah. There they go. Off to seventh and eleventh grade. Seven eleven this year. Brady's eating a nice bowl of oatmeal. Before school, oh, need a napkin? The big kids are gone. Now it's just me and you until you gotta go. As soon as you get done eating, we'll go get you dressed. Your hair's all done. Yep, Look, I'm gonna go. Looking mighty spiffy. Then I'm gonna go. <laughs> yep, and then you're gonna go. Look at you, all ready to go. Your new shoes and pants and shirt. Turn around, see your new backpack. There you go, big boy now. Under armor. Under armor. And I have good dress. Yep, turn around. You got your lunch pail in your bag and your snacks. Yep. You ready to go? Yeah. You gonna have a good day? Yep. Awesome. Thumbs up? Good job. Let's go take some pictures real quick. All right. Smile. Look at me. Good job. Smile again. There's your sign. Well, the kids are off at school. And, um, I think I'm crying more than Brady did. Brady, um, he got a little sad at the end, like when I was leaving, but... Um, I think if I would have stayed, it would have got probably worse, but it's just hard for me because he's the baby and there won't be any more and just, I guess I just don't know where five years went. So, enjoy your kids. <laughs> enjoy them while they're home. Even though they get into everything and <laughs> make a mess and it's hard to get things done. But, um, they'll have a good day. I hope they all have a good day. But we will see how their day went when they all come home. And I will let them all tell you guys how their day was. And I'm going to just edit a video and probably clean and to stay busy <laughs> so anyways so i didn't vlog when i was in school because it was really chaotic in there and there was a lot of parents so anyways he is to school and um all is good so we'll see how it does when they get home well it's that time i used to go pick up uh, our baby boy Look, all this the whole that line I of, sorry but there's a whole line of people that don't realize that you can't turn there because they didn't do anything to inform people you can't turn there. So now you have to get them, let them all back in. Yep. God, I hate driving. Road rage. <laughs> but we are on our way to go pick up our baby boy and see how his first day of school went. Jason actually got out of work early today, so it worked out because he didn't get to go this morning to see Brady go off to school, but at least he gets to be there to pick him up, which will probably really surprise Brady because he has no idea. So that'll be kind of cool. He'll be pretty excited. You think so? I think he'll be excited that you're there to come. Yeah, come pick him up. Um, I'm hoping he had a really good day and there was no, I didn't get no calls or nothing, so I'm assuming everything went well. So we will go see. Yeah. Well, Ethan and Brady are home. We're still waiting on Gracie. She'll be home soon. Brady, how was your first day? Good. And it was library day? Mm-hmm. You picked out a book. Mm-hmm. Brady's sitting here now eating the rest of his snack and he just ate the rest of his lunch. 
which is pretty common with young ones. They don't always eat everything at school, then they come home and eat it, which is fine. Is it yummy? And who put a note in your lunch pail? You. What does it say? It says, Brady, I love you. XO, XO, XO. Dad and Mom. Mm-hmm. That's pretty cool, huh? And you had two recesses today? Did you make any friends? Yeah, and on the first recess, uh, something really sad happened. What? Uh, I bumped my head right here and I cried so bad. Did somebody help you? Uh, mm-hmm. Aw, you okay? Yeah, and somebody told me something really bad too. Well, when I was on mom, 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 monkey bars, some somebody told me to just drop down, and I did. Because <laughs> some kids can. If you're scared to, then you don't do that, okay? Hey, I didn't want... The kid wasn't being mean. He was probably just saying that's how they get down. But if you don't feel comfortable with it, then don't do it, okay? Yeah. Okay, Cor Corbin was in my class. Corbin came to your class today? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's nice. So you had a pretty good day, huh? Well, good. It was pretty hot out there though, wasn't it? At least you have nice air conditioning in your school. And what did mama make you? Or make everybody, but you requested it? No, while you were gone. What's that? Brownies. Brownies? Mom made brownies, because yesterday Brady said, Mom, will you make some brownies? So I made brownies to celebrate all your guys' first day back to school. How was your first day of 11th grade? Fine. Anything exciting? No. You like all your classes? They're okay. They're okay? I thought, oh, you don't have theater arts. Gracie does, right? What do you have? Do you have an elective? I don't mean, I don't know. Oh, band. Yeah. Cool. Did you make any new friends? No, I'm in this for an exchange student. Oh, that's cool. Where? Laura. Where is she from? Spain. <laughs> cool. Foreign exchange students are cool. We were thinking about it. My favorite part about the first day back to school is all this paperwork that they bring home for us to sign. How many of you parents out there love signing all that paperwork? Or how many of you kids bring home so much paperwork for your parents to sign? Crazy! Crazy! How was school today? Good. Do you like all your classes? Mm -hmm. How many papers did you bring me to sign? One. One? Ethan brought me like three or four. That's my favorite part of the first day of school. You don't have to go. Calm down. <laughs> no, it's signing all of your papers. I know, but you don't have to go to school. So. No. I got to sit here in peace and quiet and get more work done than I normally do. And I baked a pan of brownies and I chopped up bags of vegetables. You cooking and baking. Yeah, but I can do it now because you guys aren't here. <laughs> What's your favorite class? Theater arts. Theater arts. How's your band? It's good. I and and you brought it. papers home for band? Because mm -hmm. where are we going? Mackinac. Mackinac for What's band. That? Where are we going? What That's is that? Dora. Yeah. Oh, Dora. <laughs> Grace, you used to love Dora. <laughs> your dad still does. He watches it every night. Don't judge me. <laughs> Boots. Boots. School hit Brady pretty hard today. Poor little guy. Look at this. He is whooped. Long day, long hot day at school. 
That was our back to school, first day of school <laughs> vlog. And everybody seemed to have a pretty good day. Everybody likes their classes. Oh, and a good thing was, what happened? You had said earlier you were kind of bummed because you have A lunch. Oh yeah. <laughs> Tegan got her classes switched, so now she has theater arts and band, or and lunch with me. You're kidding me. <laughs> Great news. Now you don't have to have lunch alone. Did she bring freeze dried strawberries? Ah, oh, bummer. Would you have ate all along? I doubt it. We are going to call it a night. That is the end of our oh, day. Crap. I do want to start something different now. I am going to be doing shout outs every time we close a vlog. And today, our shout out goes to the Benefil Bunch. If you have not checked out their channel, go check them out. I will have them linked down in the description below. They are a family of eight six kids and they live in Arkansas. They are a very nice, loving, fun family. They do a lot of challenges. So make sure you check them out. Show them some love and tell them that you were sent by Jennifer from The Brights. We will see you guys tomorrow. Give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to click that subscribe button if you're new to the channel and click the bell to get notifications every time we are on. Brady is crabby and tired. <laughs> we're gonna go. Remember guys, always look on the bright side and we will catch you tomorrow. Good night.